Gary Oldman burst onto our screens in the 1980s as part of a new wave of young British film actors. Beginning with leading roles in Sid and Nancy and Prick Up Your Ears, he proved he could excel across a dazzling range. Vampires, murderers, drug dealers, musicians, police officers and spies. <laughs> It's with great pleasure that we welcome Gary Oldman to BAFTA's A Life in Pictures. I tried RADA and um, uh, oh, it was an awful, awful audition and there was a panel of three and a woman who was in a sort of tweed suit with a sort of long sort of cigarette who just sort of said, well, I, I think about, I would think about to, 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 to consider something else to do for a living, Dad. <laughs> Take Taylor Soldier Spice. Were you surprised at all when you heard that there was to be a film of it? No, I wasn't surprised that, that, that they were making the movie. I was surprised that they were thinking of me for smiling. I was late one night in the Bronx, was in the trailer, and I heard a couple of kids outside walking past and I heard this voice and I said that's the voice for Drexel and so I got the kid in <laughs> pulled him off the street <laughs> and I said would you do me a favor I said would you would you record your voice for me and I said would you read these scenes and you tell me what lines don't work and then he read them and he went through the script and he went, yeah, man. He said, that don't fly. <laughs> he said, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's bull. <laughs> you know, he was like doing all this, doing all the thing. I was, cha I was changing the, the script. Mm -hmm.